What's up YouTube? Awesome you guys here coming today with another premium gold uh, box opening. So in uh, here we have five of the mini boxes. Uh, this time I'm going to open this uh, baby off camera so it uh, won't take too long of your time. So uh, I'm going to open this, get out the mini boxes and uh, I think the packs, I'm going to lay the packs uh, here and then I'll be back. So see you in a bit. And we're back. So right here I have uh, five times three of the premium gold um, packs. Uh, I kept them as they were in the mini box. So first three from the first mini box, etc. So you can see what I pull out of each mini box. So uh, without further ado, let's go right into it. I didn't really like my first opening. Uh, I didn't like what I pulled. So let's try and do a bit better out of here. And uh, that is a good start. We opened with a fire formation tanky. Gimmick Puppet Drader Doll, not bad. Uh, gimmick Puppet, uh, Gimmick Puppet Magnet, Magnet Doll. Trap Stun and Breaker the Magical Warrior. It's kind of cool. We have a Gagaga Magician. I uh, haven't seen that one uh, before in this set, by the way. Number 31. Uh, Big Belly Knight Mizuki, cool and Blackwing Armor Master. So last pack from the first mini box. Number 32, Shark Drake. And we got a bill. Oh damn. <laughs> I really wanted to pull this, but I didn't want to try and pronounce this card. But that's awesome. That's probably the best card in the set. Maybe Sliver? All right, let's see. Let's give it a try. Bills. Of the Diabolic Dragons, of Bills, Bills, whatever. A Diabolic Dragon. Awesome. So, uh, yeah, I didn't get this out of my first case. So, this might actually already be a better box. Um, Silent Warrior. But then again, that wasn't too hard. Uh, Bravekeeper Spy and Mirror Force, nice. Uh, about Gravekeeper Spy, I'm going to do a Gravekeeper deck profile relatively soon. So uh, yeah, be look out for uh, be on the lookout for that. We got a Forbidden Chalice, number 82. Um, Black Feather. Now what? Black Feather Dark Rage Dragon. Can't really see it. Yeah, Black Feather Dark Rage Dragon. Jinzo. Down, we got a lot of Jensos. And another trap stun. We got a lot of trap stuns as well now. Another Gagaga Magician. So you never see them at first, and then you get two out of the five packs. <laughs> uh, gimmick Puppet Shadow Feeler. Human Sentai Pad. Big Belly Knight, another one of him. Can't get enough of him. Chaos Sorcerer and Blackwing Armor Master. Last pack from the second mini box. And Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon, and I already saw Fusion. It has to be Blow's Ultimate Dragon. Oh no, it isn't. <laughs> I forgot about this guy. Oh, that's actually a cool pull as well. Um. Dragon Necro Nether Soul Dragon. <laughs> the Zombie Fusion. Awesome. Gaga Ga Academy. Judgment Dragon. And oh, <laughs> and there we have it Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. So we got both of the fusions in one pack. That's awesome. I really wanted to pull one of these. I just, Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon was my favorite card since the first time. I laid eyes on it. It's just amazing. So yeah, already definitely a better uh, box than last time, I think. Clips Wyfern, or Wyfern. Uh, Dreary Doll, another one. Junk Puppets, Morphing Jar, and Raiko. Another Eclipse Wyvern, 
another Beals, <laughs> awesome. So we didn't get any out of our first box, but now we got two out of our second box. So yeah, it is definitely going to be a better box. <laughs> Let's try and get three, just like I got three Winged Dragon of Ross. And whoa, yeah. <laughs> it's the second time uh, these two are together as Gold Secrets. Black Luster Soldier, Envoy of the Beginning, awesome. Also a uh, first, uh, first pull of this one. And Bonus Trap Hole, nice. So that was a pretty damn good pack. We got Dark Flare Dragon, so we're pulling all of the Chaos Dragons. Junk Puppet. Uh, Utopia Buster, first one I've pulled of this. Looks kinda cool. Uh, Kaios the Shadow Monarch and Swords of Revealing Lights. It would have been better if Swords of Concealing Light was in this set, but yeah. So uh, this is the first pack of our fourth box. So he had to pull a Sliver or an Obelisk the Tormentor, Crane Crane, um, Power Tool Mega Dragon, a Ghost of a Grudge, oh damn, it's also the first pull, first one we pulled of this. was kind of a hype card in the beginning, I never thought it was that good, uh, his requirements is too damn high. You have to, uh, your opponent has to have 8 monsters or 8 cards, 8 cards in the graveyard, so then it would be a pretty decent card, but yeah, it was a cool pull, nonetheless. Mind control and gold. So we got the full first gold gold in two cases. Let's try and get another tanky. Or our <laughs> or forbidden lands. That's fine. I'm cool with that. Uh try it's Leviah. That guy again. <laughs> Gonna really sick of that guy. And we got another ball of travel. Awesome. And Plague Spreader Zombie, cool. So we got a Mizuki and a Plague Spreader. Last pack of our second to last mini box. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. We got another Effect Healer. So this is a lot better than my first box. Just uh, number, Chaos number 40. And... Ah, my god. <clears throat> Wing Dragon of Raw. So we got four Wing Dragon of Raws. Zero Obelisk the Tormentor. Zero Slive of the Sky Dragons. Four. Four Wing Dragon of Raw. Oh wait, there's another fusion in the set. Chimera Tech Over Dragon. And Thunder King Rayo, awesome. That's pretty cool. Last three packs of our last mini box. Let's see what we can get. We got a Lone Fire, number 31, Utopia Buster, Icarus Attack, and another Chaos Sorcerer. Come on, I want an Obelisk. Oh damn, I'm dropping the pack, sorry. I'm going to try and, yeah. Galaxy Eyes Photon Dragon, uh, Chronomaly Tellu Guardian, <laughs> and thank you, thank you, we got an Obelisk the Tormentor, look at that. I was going to be really pissed if Wind Dragon of Raw really was the only God card we pulled in two cases. So two of the big boxes, ten mini boxes, thirty packs, four Wing Dragon of Raws, no. We got an Obelisk as well, awesome. Uh, Spirit Draper and Necro Gardner. Last pack. When I started this series, I wanted to have Wing Dragon Raw, Obelisk, and a Sliver. Can we get a Sliver as well? Come on. Come on. Come on. Wait, I got a Colossal Fighter. Chaos number six. Boom! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Ah, this is definitely, definitely much, much, much better than the first box. Slifer, the Sky Dragon. Awesome. Look at that. Look at that. Look at it. So we started with 
three Sly for the Sky Dragons in our first box, and in this box we got Wing Dragon for our Obelisk Tormentor, Sly for the Sky Dragon, and two, two, where's the other one? Can't find the other one, it's here. Two Beelze, or something. <laughs> Diabolic Dragons. Uh, let's see, uh, we have Gold Sark and another Kaios. So yeah, that was it for my second premium gold box opening. This was about 10 times better than the first one. Look at that. Uh, so uh, these are some of the better pulls. We got a, once again, we got one tanky, one lance, one feeler. We got two bottomless trap holes this time. That's kind of cool. Uh, we got a ghost of a, dr a grudge, actually. That's pretty decent. Crank crane. Oh, we got an Unmere for some BLS, but these three, damn. Yeah, that was an awesome box opening. I really like this one. So, in the last mini box, we got both Sliver and an Obelisk. That's pretty cool. That's pretty good. All right, uh, YouTube, that was it. Um, next pack opening is probably going to be uh, Dragons of Legends, or I believe that's what the set's called. Uh, and you'll be seeing a deck profile relatively soon. Like I said, uh, probably going to do Gravekeeper for the next deck profile. In the comment section down below, let me know what you think about my pulls. And I'll see you guys with another video. Bye!